people are arguing outside. That's what happens when you live across the street from a bar. <laughs> Woo! <sighs> Some of these papers, I don't know. I swear, you guys, this light thing, I'm gonna have to move. I'm gonna have to move something. Um, or just be really bright. Hello! <laughs> Um, hi. Well, um, you know, mom mentioned about my feelings being hurt and Tammy, if you're watching this, I can totally understand where you got the, where you could see, have thought that she was talking about you, but it, it was, um, I actually, um, putting it out here for the world, huh? Um. The thing that I've been working on so hard and the reason I haven't been around and <clears throat> the, um, the thing, you know, I, I take, I take my job very seriously, um, even though I complain about it a lot, but, um, everything that I do in my job is a lot of times I'm the creator of databases or of of workflow or I'm the person that works with the with the the, the our clients from beginning to end you know um, so they're kind of and you know I don't have any human children I have I have animals of course but um, so a lot of times and, and as much time as as the my job takes up that you guys obviously realize how much that is but um it's like these these case these these projects are my babies you know i mean i i start them from infancy and i help them grow into whatever you know and um and that's one of the reasons why i work as hard as i do because i really do care about the these things that i'm doing um so anyway so for whatever reason, what, you know, there, there were a couple of things that happened during this one case. Um, and there were some complaints from the clients and, um, they weren't, I mean, you know, there were, there were, uh, there was at least one complaint that was very valid. And, um, two, two things that they said, one was that I wasn't local to, cause I'm not in California, which really, I mean, I don't think that's a very valid argument because to be quite honest, I can do my job from anywhere in the world. I mean, I, the only thing that I can't physically do is put a CD or, or into a drive or a DVD into a drive, uh, or plug a hard drive in or whatever. Um, but everything else, once that piece of media, whatever it is, is where it's supposed to be, then I can do anything from where I'm sitting or from anywhere because I, I can remote into all the computers in all of our offices and all that stuff. Uh, so that to me isn't a very valid complaint, but that was one of their complaints. They, they were apparently under the impression that I was out in California and that was my home and everything. And I can't even imagine where they would have gotten that idea because I think in the first meeting we had with them, I actually talked about, uh, you know, Missouri and Kansas City and barbecue and because that's, you know, that's one of the things that that always gets brought up because that's one of the things that Kansas City's known for. <laughs> um, and then the second complaint was that, you know, let me just let me just put this stuff out here. And, and this is just me getting it out, you know, but um, I've been in the computer industry for at least 20 years. I mean, you know, I started working with computers in high school and have have and that was programming and um, database playing around I won't call it management in high school but um, learning <clears throat> learning about databases learning about programming um, you know and and I, I owned my own computer company at one point and I did in-home training and I did web design and desktop publishing and all kinds of stuff I mean so I've been in, I've been around the block I guess <laughs> with computers um, so, and you know, thankfully I had that computer background when I started in the industry that I'm in now, um, because otherwise I would have been completely jacked. I mean, I wouldn't have known, 
I wouldn't have had any idea, especially the amount of databases that I work with. That's that's one of the biggest things that we deal with is, is data or databases. So um, my point is, I, I know computers. You know, I mean, that's if if I'm not good at anything else, I'm good with computers. Um, you know, I may not know everything there is to know, and I don't think everybody anybody could. I don't think anybody could know every single thing there is to know about a computer. It's just there's too much to know. But <clears throat> for the most part, if I don't know it and if I need to know it, then I'm going to learn it. And there's this one software that we just got um, that's really cool. I love the software. It's very it's very neat software. It's a, it's an online um, database software basically. So you can load documents and you can view the documents um, and you can uh, you know make notes about them and cre create um, well anyway it's, uh, if I go into that it'll take the whole video but anyway so it's a really cool piece of software um, and, and I mean it's it's basically a database in the background and then you have this really pretty interface that you can do different stuff with well <clears throat> I, I had because we just got it obviously we hadn't had um, a project with it yet and so this was would this particular case was my first time with this project. I'm sorry, this particular project was the first time with the software. Um, so anyway, so um, the oh, it's already six minutes. God dang it! Well, the point is, there were a couple of complaints. There were some things that happened that could have gone a little bit better, I guess, but they wound up firing us, my my company which really they fired me and because I had brought this thing up from its infancy and I created the thing the database I created the interface um, I got everything how it's supposed to be it hurt my feelings it really hurt my feelings I mean it was it was more than just a business decision on their part because honestly the, I, I've racked my brain to try to figure out exactly what well, how I could have done anything better or or differently to make it to have made it better for them um and really I can't think of anything I mean I I <laughs> um did everything I could I mean I stayed up non-stop I did everything I could and, and you know that I think at, at and the, to use a phrase that my boss uses a lot that I wouldn't normally use but at this point at the end of the day is what he says um, I did everything I could you know and for them to take it away um, was really a blow to my ego um, it hurt my feelings and and they still and this is the best part <laughs> and they still have the nerve to call me and ask me questions about it and you know it, it takes everything I have to continue to be professional and to not say screw you guys I am I'm not you fired me I'm done <laughs> I don't want to deal with this anymore um, you know I spit I, I gave up valuable time with my family and my friends and my husband to work on this project so you know this that's I'm I'm going through the stages of of not or not denial of grief, you know, where at first you're upset and or do you deny it and then you're I don't know what how they're supposed to go, but <coughs> you know what I mean. So <coughs> that that that's what mom was talking about in her video, um, that my feelings got hurt and and you know it's it's really because. I care about what I do and I care about the people that I work with and not just my coworkers but my clients too and um, for them to make that sort of a decision and not even I mean it was a shock to me too because my boss just called me up and said they took it away so and the icing on the cake is that I am the person who has to help with the transition to the other company So I hope you guys are having a great weekend. I'm having a good weekend. I got to see my family today. Um, I, I came home, did some work on something else. Um, I've been getting to spend time with my husband. And um, I'm actually going to try to clean up the mess behind me. <laughs> so, um, so actually, blessing in disguise, yes. Um, yes, I'm hard on myself, but eh. 
Anyway, have a great rest of your weekend. We'll talk to you soon.